Pop. So now in this video, I'm going to show you a few things that I've learned while I've been uh, using a set of Corsa. Like people always ask me, how do you show when you pull on the handbrake, like on the pedal box, like right on the screen on the left hand side there, you see that little box square thing there. So you get that from your uh, pure planner, the fill on the, on the corner, it pops out, you get it, but you need to toggle on a setting within content manager. And I'm gonna show you how to do that right now. Cause if not, you just see the throttle, the clutch and the brake. You don't see when you pull on your handbrake and some people wanna have that there also. So with that being said, oh, and you see the steering wheel if I'm not mistaken, I seen that the other day pop up. I don't know why. I, I want to take that one off. I don't think the steering wheel should be there. But whatever. Let's get to it. Uh, so in the pedal box that you're about to see right now, as I was doing this video, I noticed, like, there's another. Check it out. Look, look, look. There's something else there that I don't know where it came from or what is it. It seems like it's like the force feedback or the wheel. But anyway, I'm going to show you how you see the handbrake, right? right there on the corner and the bottom the pedal box you're gonna see me move it you see it i'm hovering over it it's one two three line see it right here I'm trying to make it bigger one two three four five this fifth one is for the handbrake the yellow one that green is throttle. The red is your brakes, and that's the clutch. Throttle, acceleration, when you hit the gas. is the green one, right? Because <laughs> everybody had a million words for it. So we're going to put it back here, and we're going to leave it a little big. We're going to pin it. So I'm going to show you where you find it over here. Look, every time you use it, look. Now that setting is right here. I didn't even, cause for some reason it erased from my game. And I was like, hold up, why am I not seeing none of my handbrakes show up? Even though you can only use one handbrake, you can only use one handbrake here in a settle, but in CarX it lets you incorporate two for some apparent reason. 
the things you're gonna need too but i use both <laughs> believe it or not so anyway this is where the setting is at right Pop, you go to settings you go to custom shaders patch and right here on the left hand side it send this says gui pop and you see right here i'm gonna just move this over because so, i think my camera is over it so right here pop you see it right there it says show handbrake bar in pedal app <clears throat> now the only thing that we i can't find now because after i've found this like i'm like hold up because i knew where it was at but i forgot it's been a long time so you know we just turned these settings on pop and keep it moving <laughs> and months ago by a year i haven't been drifting for that long or sim racing it's only been like a year a year and change or something like that but uh anyway <clears throat> with that i've been gaming since i was a, a baby but i'm talking about sim racing and drifting so anyway pop i found it again and it took me like forever but now for some apparent reason maybe you guys could tell me whoever sees this <laughs> what is this now that i told you about that setting and i'm gonna tell you about a lot more for those that like to see content like this and i'm only and i'm also gonna show you windows how to make videos yada 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 right but today is a set of course of content manager now tell me what's this someone explain to me what is this let's see what the fps was while i was over there i like to check that oh okay not bad not bad it's usually more but i'll settle for that for it being a 1440p max settings all around the board I'll settle. But anyway, check it out. What is this? Let me know. If you know, let me know. What's this? All right, so you see down here, there's one, that's the blue one, right? That's clutch, I'm hitting the clutch. That's the brake, right? That's the throttle, the green. Now, what is this next one that came up out of nowhere while I was trying to make this video? This is the handbrake. Now, this one in the middle seems to be working like when I hit a wall or something. If you wanna learn how to put this dashboard on the right-hand side over here, uh, I mean, uh, the gauges, let me know because I also connected it to my to one of my phones that I had, an older phone, and I made it red and yellow right here. The, see it? So when I hit the gas, you see it? And when I change gears. Alright, let me know. I'll make that video next. But look at look at when I hit the wall. That's when it works, I think. You see it turn gray, and then sometimes it turns red. It's the one next to the green on the to the right. Look, you see it turn red now. When I hit a corner, it looks like. But when it, the wheel turns. What is that? What is that? Yeah. You see it? 
these cars be all over the place because I have a super strong neck effect on. <laughs> I like it that way. I don't know why, but it works better, like the controlling of the car, when I actually had it this way. I'll show you right now. Controls. Pop. You see, it's a 900 here. I'm able to control the car better, or it feels better for me with this car, when it's in 1080. But for some apparent reason, on my Fanatic wheel, right? On the on the calibration of the wheel in the Fanatic uh, app is at 900. And here is at 1080. And for some apparent reason, I just get a way better feel of the car and all that. I don't know why. And I could, I feel like I'm... Now, there's a lot slower cars that you could do this with, so you don't have to, like... I started with, like, cars at a thousand, but actually there's, like, some cool cars that are, like, just at 400 and all that, and they feel less powerful, and you could control them better, right? There's a lot of them like that, but I'll show you, like, this one right here I was using earlier. Uh, this is an awesome car right here. I just don't like the way it sounds. But this is a great car to start with. Look, and it's only 392. The one I was just in is a thousand plus. Super strong. This is a good car to start with. I'll put the link in the description just in case to the car. It's just a lot. I gotta go get them links and all that, but... I'll probably put it there. <laughs> the only thing I hate the way it sounds. And it's... I don't know. And the inside is not all that. But it's cool. Oh, this is the guy? Look, I like to use him like this. If this is him. I don't know why, I guess when I'm bugging out and playing around and I'm just having fun by myself, I use them like this. I ain't even gonna lie. Like if I'm not making a video and I'm alone and I just wanna bug out, I bug out like this. I think it looks cool in the big screen. In the big screen, it just looks cool to me. <laughs> Look, I'm going to remove myself from here so you can see how it looks. Uh, how do I remove this camera again? I forgot. <laughs> oh, look. I bug out. <laughs>
cars are just slower, but they give a good drift. There's a lot of cars that are this slow, and they suck. They don't go nowhere. This one is good. I need the lights. Where the lights? That didn't, that didn't help. about this car I don't know if it's even like they could have put more work into this car even though it's a drift I know like what else you want right but it's cool though I think it's neat there's a lot way better ones though but this is a great car to start with and everybody says that and they wasn't wrong but I learned how to get the little bit of drifting that I know wasn't even in a settle. It was in Car X, believe it or not. It helped me a lot. A settle, I thought like this is impossible. They lying. <clears throat> they lying. This none of this works. But then I realized that it wasn't the game. It was me. <laughs> so anyway, uh Let me know what you think, bro. I don't know if you got anything out of this. Did you, bro? I'm getting hot. I need to get wet. Thank you. 